Let's go, guys. Next here, welcome to the Destiny 2 beta. Um, Destiny 2 beta went live yesterday, and for PS4 users, we're getting to play it first. Uh, yeah, no, rip Xbox One fans and the PC fans. What I'm playing on is my Warlock, which I am um, like so far. And um, the Dawnblade is pretty fun class to use. Much harder than people were thinking it was going to be, I think. The actual super for it. And um, what it has is it has Daybreak, uh, Healing Rift, when you hold circle, you heal yourself if you're, it's in like a small area. Or Empowering Rift, which gives you increased weapon damage. Sort of like uh, Weapons of Life from the Bubble, except this is just like a little ring you sit in. And um, there's the, obviously the normal jumps again. I use burst because I like fast speed. You got the solar, the fireball, the fusion. Same as always, but what's important to note is fusion grenades are not one shots anymore. They only deal damage, really. Like, I think it's it's pretty much half health, nearly nearly uh, three quarters. Not a lot of not an awful lot of damage. Um, and then there's these things down here. Um, I haven't unlocked them, so you won't see them. But you can, like see, strike an enemy with this melee ability to burn them and cause them exp to explode when killed. Uh, hold circle while in midair to quickly descend and restore your health. Um, while the daybreak is active, descend causes explosive damage. That would be actually really fun to use. And um, kill them with daybreak descent saturation, which would be good as well, because it does run out pretty quickly when you're slicing everything, or like just chucking fireballs everywhere. Um, and the daybreak projectiles seek targets as they travel. That would be good because the aiming on this is kind of not really hard. It's just it's not. It's, well, I wouldn't say it's hard, but I wouldn't say it's easy either. It uh, it does require a bit of skill to aim with this thing now. And um, you've got your airborne kills, your charge grenade, and me melee energy casting daybreak instantly refills all your ability energy. Um, this is the new Icarus dash, which is basically the Twilight Garrison um, dash. A double circle while midair to dodge. It, it, it's the same animation that the Twilight Garrison used to use as well, except on a warlock. Um, strike an enemy with this melee ability to burn your target and temporarily increase your movement and reload speed. And then there's Winged Sun, which is engage your enemies mid-flight, fire weapons and throw grenades while gliding. And um, this, the Warlock now is really kind of based on, remember that Angel of Light in Destiny 1? It's really based on like airborne, floating, shooting, it's death from above basically, it's like an AC-130 or something. What I'm going to do is go into um, Quick Play. There is three things, it's competitive, which is the new countdown mode, I'll do that after a Quick Play match. And then there's the Inverted Spire Strike, which <laughs> there's a lot of... Um, a lot of stuff about how to get to the law sector and everything through this. I haven't done it myself. I've just been on YouTube watching it and stuff like that. Loads of like Easter eggs and like glitches and tricks to get into it. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into quick play first. Now quick play this like in this is really just control. Um, It's the control from Destiny 1. It's the exact same. What we're playing on. I forget the name of the map. You'll see it in a second. It's, uh, it's a really small close quarters map. Which they said was. I think one of the things they're going to try to keep, because it is 4v4s now, and endless veil. Um, it is 4v4 uh, game modes now, meaning because since it's a smaller map, it's not too clustered. I will say there is some points where the spawns are all over the place. It happens in some matches and you just like, Control. what the hell is going on? Uh, two titans and warlock and a hunter. Good, good combo. Um, it is a lovely looking map though. Like. They go I know people are saying, oh, it's just a reskin, but the graphics actually do look a lot better. And so does the gameplay. And, like, the uh, the way, like, your explosions and everything work now as well, they look better. Oh, they're going to chase me. Get rid of the grape. Grape. Okay, let's go. Um, the way the, like, I was going to call it magic, but it's, it's like, the way your uh, abilities and everything look, look a lot better. And shot at. Whoa. Oh, that guy's in the way. Oh, God, I'm alive. Get him, get him. Oh, there's a Twilight Garrison as well. <laughs> it's actually so handy on the Warlock now. Because the Warlock really never had anything to actually, like, get away from people. That blink, but that was about it. You never really had, uh, like, a Twilight Garrison or a Shade Step, like the Hunter and the uh, Titan had. So it's kind of just, like, payback for that. Giving you a new one. That's an enemy thing. Oh, shit. Oh, that guy's in the way. Oh, I got a kill. Oh, yeah, that's the new, uh, the new way they've decided to, like, do the scoring. Is, um, it's by opponents. It's called efficiency at the end. That's, like, your new KD type thing. 
But that takes into account. Oh, he's just he's on top of us. Get up. We got him. Um, it's efficiency. Is your like your new KD? That takes into account all the like kills you've got and all the sort of um, like if you get an assist, it counts as a kill now. Well, not really. It counts as an opponent defeated. It's not kills anymore. Opponents defeated. That's a grenade. That's a trip mine. Oh, I got him! I got him! I got payback for you, bro. Don't worry, I got payback. Um, as I said, yeah, I don't even know what it's talking about anymore. Oh crap! We got him! Oh, the no scope. Oh, that guy's. Guys, we're getting conquered. Yeah, I probably should be capping points instead of just killing people. Oh, I got a god. Oh, he, he's using nightshade as well. Hey, yeah, that's the pulse rifle I'm using. That pulse rifle I'm using at the moment is the nightshade. Um, it's kinetic. It's not the energy weapon. My energy is the sidearm. Um, it's actually it's a really good pulse. I'm not gonna lie. Um, it does a fair bit of damage, and it has uh, the extra like node it has or ability it has is if I get a kill with this weapon and I reload, the next like bullets are gonna be stronger. Uh, I'm weak. He's using that. Yeah, everyone's really using the nightshade. It is probably it. <laughs> honestly it's the best uh, best gun I'd say from the beta. Like overall, like the hand cannons aren't bad. And uh, the range does really kill them a bit. And then the scout rifle, I think the Titan has it, isn't too bad either. It's just, it's real slow, like it's really slow rate of fire. Oh, please don't let that warlock get away. I got him. And it's a really slow rate of fire scout. And when I say slow, I mean it's terribly slow. It does a, really, it does a lot of damage, but when you're up against something like this, like the nightshade and stuff, it's you most times you just lose out. Oh, let me get it! Let me get it! Yes. Oh shit! Now show them the true of I'm gonna die. Yeah, I knew it. See, that's the new uh, power ammo spawns and boxes now on the map like that. It's really um. I would I say it comes pretty often. Like that one, it's a minute I think each one. The games last about eight minutes, so like eight times. There, thereabouts. Ooh, please survive. Buddy, help me. Oh, Ooh, what? Three minutes remaining. Alright, survive that. Survive that. Oh, fight. Oh, no, oh, my God, there's too many people. Take this without a fight. I tried taking points, I was stuck by myself. Yeah, my team are really just interested in kills, I think. I mean, it is the beta, so everyone's just like, oh, I don't really give a shit about anything else except for getting kills. I want to showcase everything. Here is the new Dawnblade. Oh, strike. Strike. No, get him. That's what I mean by the aiming is really hard to do. You're almost better off staying on the ground and just aiming straight, and that's a sniper. You're just, you're better off staying on the ground and just aiming straight. And running into people with it and just sniping. Well, time to hang up the boots! Oh yeah, there's new sit and everything as well. I don't know... I don't even know what sort of character I am. Am I human? Or... Oh, it doesn't say. Well, I did get to the other hand cannon. Um... I already had it as well. What I'm gonna go into now, I'm gonna try to do countdown though, because <laughs> that just didn't go well at all. I mean, I got 12 opponents defeated. It's actually hard not to say kills. I got 12 opponents defeated. Um, my team <laughs> didn't do well at all. But this is countdown now, which the map actually for countdown is Midtown. It's on Earth. It's, um, you'll see it now. It's pretty small. Actually, it is really small. Uh, countdown is basically there's two um, two locations. They're called charges charge sites. Uh, two charges you can plant. Uh, one in where they've marked it, see mar market or rugs. And um, what I'm doing now, we're attacking. And um, you pick one, and you go to it. Well, we split into two. Usually the defending team will split into two and try hold down one. Uh, you kind of you just have to guess which one people are going to go to. Uh, a lot of people usually go to this one. 
at rugs. Well, the defending team just goes to rugs because it's uh, really enclosed. It's easier like to kind of defend against or hide from uh, the enemies defending as well. Oh, he's got it. Oh, there's a triple. Oh, the triple kill. Yes. Haha. <laughs> Screw you guys. Going for your power ammo. <laughs> there's a team wipe. Going for their, <laughs> they were going for their uh, power ammo. See, that's the thing. with In this game mode, Countdown, some people are just oblivious. And they uh, they just try like planting a bomb when there's people in front of them. Or else they'll try to defuse. They literally try to defuse it. And you're sitting there guarding it. And they just don't realize that you're there. They just don't do anything. Um, oh, yeah. Everyone's going to be here. Come on, pop your head around. See, that's where you all do, like Usually the attackers all group up in there. Shit, I think they're going over to the other side. Oh. What did I? Oh my god, I dodged into a lightning grenade. Yeah, we might lose this one. They're gonna plant it up at, uh, at Rugs, I'd say. Where I just died. Where are we going, boys? Are we going to market? Let's go to market. Nope. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, I forgot. Everyone's. Oh my god, that's funny, you guys. Oh, we have tree hunters as well. See, everyone comes over this way. So they all know. Oh, they all know we're gonna be here. Yeah, I'm not going in there when a new one action bot will follow me. Okay, we got one. One of them got the sniper. Oh, please kill him. Yes, he's dead. Hey. That was easy. Those Titan shields as well. They are like the these knees. I'm telling they, they are so clutch in this game mode. Because you can initially put the shield up and like hide and plant the bomb and then run. And then just defend it from far. It's <laughs> kind of a cheese. Um because you're not really going to run in and try to kill someone after they planted it. Oh, yeah, I should not have went like that. Oh, buddy, come back. Okay, we got him running. He's half health. Um, oh, hello, boy. Oh, oh, my God, that's the black scorpion. Only one minute left. Shouldn't have died to him. Yeah, we're going to lose this. It's actually it's a lot easier to attack than defend in this game mode, which I think they probably should balance. Because I mean, you haven't well, I haven't planted a bomb, um, but when you're planting a bomb, it literally it's two seconds to plant. It's nothing, and then see fuse. It, it takes about eight seconds, I'd say, eight ten seconds. It's really it's it's actually unfair to be honest. I mean, obviously you shouldn't be able to defuse it in like two seconds, or you just go in and plant a wall and defuse. But you shouldn't be able to plant it that quick either. Yeah, there's one guy I know who's defending this side. Oh, I'm getting the power armor, boy. Ah, I got it. Crush them. One minute left. Oh, quick scope. Hey, where is he? It's the new sniper as well. Sniped. I planted this bomb. I planted it. Now we just have to defend here, so... They'll most likely come down this way. They got a revive. I don't know which side they're going to come from. Oh, there he is. There's a snipe. There's a snipe. <laughs> oh, I thought they got a revive. The snipers in this game are so nice. I mean, like, they are just got uh, three headshots, I think. It sort of reminds me of the old Halo snipers. Where it was kind of like, like just literally, you could no-scope with them. I don't, I don't think these are dead straight. But they're like, the shot is real nice. It's like a little, it's like a little, like, like a little whipped sort of noise. So beautifully done. Hey, right, you're using a shotgun. You should have killed at least one person there. Uh, and there goes the bomb. The other thing that they need to probably add into the game is telling you how long you have left for the bomb to explode. Like all it does is make noise. It doesn't like say like 10 seconds left to an explosion. It's just literally just noise. I, obviously, this is the beta, so like they're got probably add all that in and two people for fuck's sake. Okay, we're gonna have to clutch this. Can't clutch it if I'm dead though. Yeah, I'm dead. Alright, I just I got no hits on him. Oh, I did. Cause he killed him. They're gonna go rogues though. Oh, the straight on that. Rip. <laughs> Buddy, can you do this by yourself? Alright, that was a terrible skip, mate. Oh go on, get him, get him, get him, get him. 
Yes, there we go. Oh, they got the res. Okay, we, we, we can get we can do this. I mean, if we get three, we might have a chance. I think two is a bit of a tall ask. Um, so I have the most kills as well. Show them how little that means. Um, my super is probably not going to help too much because I can't aim for shit with the Dom Blade. As you've probably as you've seen in the last match. Uh, they've got a smash. And an overbomb. No. Run, run, run. And that was a face, for God's sake. You're all down. I probably just should have just used my Dom Blade. <laughs> Oh, that was a horrible match. It was going so well. I got the montage Scott I got the montage snipes. Triple snipe headshots. And then they decide to quit. There you have it. That is the Warlock gameplay. Um I didn't really use the Voidwalker. Uh, I might make a video on it, I don't know. Voidwalker isn't my favourite class. And as you've seen there, like your man, he threw a Nova Bomb right at my right at my feet. I jumped up but it didn't hit me. And I kind of escaped from it. The action bots would follow you and hit, kill you, but like the level bomb is kind of nerfed now. It's not as good as it used to be. Maybe with the uh, new sub, uh, like the trees here, they might make it better, but nah, it wasn't great there. But regardless, that's it for me. Um, if you liked the video, throw us a like. I mean, you want to see more. There's probably going to be a ton of Destiny 2 beta uh, content anyway coming from me anyway over the next few days. Um, subscribe if you want to see that. And hopefully I'll see you in the next one.